I used this diffusion material from this broken television to take this image of my camera. I'm using a Nikon D850 and the lens is a 105mm f2.8 micro Nikkor. This is a high sense television that fell from the wall mounting and the front screen has broken. Please take care while dismantling this. I am doing this without using gloves because I know exactly what I am doing. As you can see, the front, this front panel, the black portion is made of glass and is very very delicate so it might break and you might get injured. This is the diffusion material that they use in all LED TVs and all sorts of TVs, televisions. So this is what I'm using, I'm going to use for my photography as a diffusion material. The other back of the diffusion material is uh, quite hard and it broke while I was uh, trying to get it out but this too can be used as a diffusion material for photography. This diffusion material that's at the back of the previous diffusion material in the television is quite thick and fragile so be careful while removing, removing this and it makes a perfect uh, diffusion material for photography. taken this first shot with the flash on and without any diffusion material in front. You can see how harsh the lighting is directly with the flash and without any diffusion material in front of it. I'm putting this diffusion material, I'm using two of them in front of the flash
these shots are with the direct flash and with the diffusion in front of it. My camera is set to a 5 second timing. I take multiple shots adjusting the focal length towards the subject. These are the various shots that I have taken. using Helicon Focus to focus stack all these images. I'm using Topaz Denoise AI to denoise these images that have been focus stacked.
next use Topaz Sharpen AI to further sharpen the images. This is how the image comes out after sharpening. I next use Capture One Pro to improve the image. Please like and subscribe if you can. Thank you.